video desync that I am forced to use for console. So video desync. My audio is at least audible. Uh, let's go at everyone. Um, Meg, how do you spell Megami? Exactly how I think you do. Megami Ebon Roku Persona. Persona 1, exclamation point. And then that starts that. We can cut that out. And we can bring this up. And then we can switch over here. And I shouldn't have a desync issue over here. So let's see. Can minimize that. That all looks fine. And let's see. Uh, two, three, and one. I don't have a lot of notes for this. So X should be that. Hopefully I stuck with my standard. Mmm, that's loud. The game I was waiting for, I won't be able to fucking sing it. Love you too. Oh, is the... Really? At 1 a.m.? Oh, wow. Well, we'll refresh at 1 for you. Welcome, Nate. How you doing? Uh, so I looked around at some walkthroughs for this game, and the notes you gave me are actually better than any of the walkthroughs I found, so I'm just using those. So, uh, thank you? Uh, but also, if anything goes wrong, it's your fault. Why were there people in those cells? Yeah, really. Yeah, your notes were, like, way better. For, for like, base playthrough, at least. Uh, I did find a legitimate walkthrough for Snow Queen, but only Snow Queen, which is kind of weird. <laughs> Something may go wrong because I never played this first. <laughs> I will say, in this cutscene, uh, Philemon appears almost green. So, maybe he should stop adding colors to his repertoire. Press any button. I'm certainly hitting a button, game. There we go. Movie mode. Continue. Load game. New game. Let's go new game. Before beginning the game, please choose a difficulty setting, bitch. Bitch is for players unused to strategizing in battle. Correct. I have never played an RPG. Which is why I gave no advice whatsoever for dungeons, because Atlas changed all the map. Yep. I gotcha. <sighs> Once I dreamt I was a butterfly. I forgot myself and knew only my happiness as a butterfly. Soon I awoke and I was myself again. Did I dream that I was a butterfly? Or do I now dream that I am a man? Yet there is a distinction between myself and the butterfly. This is the transformation of the physical. Zhuangzi. Well, it also doesn't actually matter which one's which, because whichever one it is, you are that one at this exact moment, so just deal with that. You know what? We'll take it as it comes. Perso 
Why is there a moon counter in the corner of the screen? Persona? Dude, if that really worked and I could see the future, it'd be an easy street. You sure you ain't got the brain rot, Hidako? Hidahiko? Masao Inaba, nicknamed Mark, the spoiled son of the Inaba dry cleanings owner, earnest and excitable. Haha, <laughs> turns out there's more to it than an easy joke. Maybe not seeing the future exactly, but weird stuff does happen. I'm willing to put my money where my mouth is if you are, Mark. Kitahiko Usugi, nicknamed Brown, craves attention and doesn't take things very seriously. Alright, you're on. I'll bet you an all-you-can-eat dinner at Peace Diner on Joy Street. Oddly specific. Moon cycles and SMT affect demons at full moon. Demons are stronger and impossible to negotiate with. Okay, alright. So a new moon, are they weaker and easier to negotiate with? Woo, I'm with Hidehiko. Yuka Ayasa, nickname Ayasa. Wow, what an amazing nickname that is. A troublemaking member of the sun-tanned, bleach-blonde Kogel set. I'll throw my lot in with Brown, too. Eriko Kirishima, nickname Ellie, a ladylike student recently returned from abroad, beautiful and intelligent. She's the perfect student, then, to use my fake British accent with, because then it sounds like she's trying to put on a British accent, but failing. Are you guys serious? Yeah, okay, you can know. What are you guys gonna side with? Hmm. <laughs> As if I care one whit. It's absolute bunk. K Nanjo, nickname Nanjo. Heir to the Nanjo group, an utter pragmatist and skeptic. Eh, skeptic. I can speak. You can't. Shut up. Oh shit, is this young Yukino? Aw, her hair's not fluffy anymore. What he said, this is all on you. Yukino Mayazumi, nickname Yukino. Trusted by everyone, she's like an older sister to all the students. Also, I'll teach you about positioning when the time comes, since the first hour of this is going to be you walking around town. Okay. As is every Persona. <laughs> Actually, no, I will say that Persona 2... Nope, I forgot about the fact that we spent almost two uninterrupted hours wandering around the school aimlessly. Never mind. Every Persona starts like that. <laughs> Ugh, you guys are so cold, you know? Hey, who are you with? It's gotta be me, right? Come on, what's it gonna be? Uh, oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit, I wasn't paying nearly enough attention. Uh, uh. I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with Brown. Sheesh, you two, y'all's crazy. Heh <laughs> this'll be fun. Alright, let's get started. Okay, here goes. Um, Persona, Persona, come here. Please come here. Not my best, but I don't care. My turn. Persona, Persona, come here. Man, why do I gotta do this? Mark's voice spontaneously 180 Hurry up, all you can eat. All you can eat. Yeah, okay, okay. <laughs> persona, persona, come here, I guess. Well then, persona, persona, please come to us. All right, here it comes. Also, your fake British accent will be perfect because in Eternal Punishment, Amanda Wynn Lee did a really fake accent. Awesome. <laughs> Hidehiko, you jerk. Now I look like a total idiot. Hey, 
See, what a fat load of nothing. Heh, <laughs> looks like I win. <sighs> Happy now. Hurry up and go get the teacher. W wait, hold up. One more time, please. Mark screwed it up. Come on, you gotta take it seriously when you do it. Oh, you little. What a sore loser. That's a fucking ghost. <laughs> that fucking reaction huh? shot. It's too late now to ask to. Whoa! Why is there just a one on his on his uh, ascot? Help me. What? What the? You can help. Welcome. It's a pleasure to meet you. I am Philemon, a dweller between consciousness and unconsciousness. And now, a simple test. Can you state your name? That's called subconsciousness, Philemon. Uh, okay. Our name is... T. Oh. I like how I tried to use circle. Because <laughs> we've been playing so much Final Fantasy. PS1 version of this cutscene, you see weird shit flashing in your face while you follow the butterfly, like a math equation, a clock, DNA, a ceiling fan. <laughs> oh, really? You kind of see that in the opening of the game. T. Oh. You. D O U First name N A O Y A Toto now ya uh, that is the manga name, because there is no official name for Earring Boy. The closest official name to Earring Boy is Earring Boy, and I'm not gonna call the character Earring Boy. So... <laughs> I did think of it, though. I did, I did consider it. <laughs> uh, nickname, Naurin. There we go. Toto Nauya, nickname Nowrin. Perfect. And then I don't actually need these notes for a while, I assume. Splendid. There aren't many who can remember their identity when in this domain. Man, so imagine that Imagine getting your persona. But tell me this. And then your persona is a ceiling you aware fan of the many and varied selves you harbor within you. The self suffused with divine love. The self capable of demonic cruelty. People live by wearing different masks. Your current self may be only one of those innumerable masks. You, though, you have a very firm grip on your identity. I respect your strong will. In return. Oh yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna bother with uh, Chris or whatever his name is. It is the power to summon the selves within you, the gods and the demons you harbor. The time is soon when you will need this power. Now, you must return. 
to your proper time and place. It it sounds more like a fun bonus thing you can do than something you're like intended to be doing. So you guys had the same dream. Indeed, it's rather extraordinary. Think he's seeing it now too? That tree is pink. Teacher in nurse's uniform. I need a teacher in nurse's uniform voice, huh? Oh, now, yeah, you've come around. Wow, why? Okay. Haha, -ha, welcome to the infirm. You sure look cute when you're asleep. Natsumi Yoshino, St. Hermlin's Heist Nurse. She doesn't seem to be a very good cook. Uh, uh, okay. Okay, Persona 1. I challenge you to name a Persona girl that is a good cook. I'm waiting. I actually can't think of one. Is there a Persona girl that's actually good at cooking? That's- you know what? You know what? Fuck everything. You know what I want for Persona 6? I want a girl that's good at cooking. That's what I want in Persona 6. I want a girl that can cook for once. Now, yeah, are you alright? Her gimmick is that she sounds exasperated at all times. Thank goodness you're awake now, yeah. Thanks to the PSP limitations, you won't hear the normal student uh, school theme, which is xylophones. Okay. It's this interesting choice. I was so scared when I heard you'd collapsed. Saiko Takami, homeroom teacher for Naoya and the others. Very popular with the students. I'm sorry you had to deal with my students, Natsumi. Come on, taking care of students is their whole job. What's so bad about us? Now, now, Masao, I want you to think about what you've done. Anyway, Eriko and Ayasa told me what happened. No helping out for you today. No, actually, it looks like her real accent is that I will read her lines weird. Instead, go get yourselves checked out at Mikage Hospital and head home. So, you think something's wrong with us, too? Oh, not like that. I can tell by looking at you that you're perfectly sane. Are you going to walk around and talk to NPCs? I'm going to talk to every NPC available. And save during it so we don't accidentally trigger Snow Queen. Because when reading the notes on Snow Queen, which I didn't bother to copy down, one of my immediate thoughts was, oh dear god, I could trigger that on accident. But I'm worried you might have gotten hurt while collapsing, so go see the doc. So there is something that can phase you, Miss Saiko. All right, we'll go. Speaking of, mm -mm. speaking of Mikage Hospital, wasn't a student in your class staying there? Before the hospital, go directly forward and out the right door. Okay. You mean Mark, right? Yes, that's right. You should visit her while you're there. She's been laid up there for over a year now. I'm sure she's lonesome. Oh, is this on a four-dimensional axis? Oh, that's gonna... That's gonna get weird. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 oh dear. Okay. I got a medicine. Four-dimensional access? I meant two-dimensional access. I meant the exact opposite of what my mouth said. This is an Agaiasta tree. Young ones, your pres- Young ones, your presence is welcome. Will you inscribe your story onto me? Sure, I'll inscribe my story onto you, pink glowing tree in the nurse's office. <laughs> this is- the weirdest save point in Persona history. You cannot convince me otherwise. 
I put a new plant there. What do you think? Livens up the room, doesn't it? Are you aware it talks with an ominously deep voice? That's what I liked about it. They say plants grow better if you talk to them. Give it a try now, ya. Oh god, this access thing is gonna be so weird. It seems we have no choice in the matter. Best get it over with. McKage Hospital, huh? Yeah, it's the kind of long walk from school. It's way to the northeast. You leave the school, head north, go all the way to the third ward, then take a ride at the McKage Ruins. Eh, if we just wander around, we'll get there sooner or later. Oh my god, the controls on this are gonna be so fucking weird. What were you doing anyway? I asked you to prepare for the sports festival. We only have a month left and nothing's ready yet. Should we just cancel it this year? The school is three floors and many doors are locked. Okay, my kind of school. Shit's locked. Hi, Yukino. I know I couldn't take being cooped up in a hospital for an entire year. Let's go cheer her up. You really built yourself into a corner giving me a normal voice last game, because now you're not going to have me in the entire party the whole time. <laughs> hey! Look at that shit! That's a three-dimensional classroom, which is probably better, because I can probably navigate it easier now. Uh, okay, you said go at the door, door on the right. So I see the issue already. Uh, is it time you gave up on Yosuke? He obviously a uh, Yosuke. Mhm, mm mhm, mm mhm. Mm yeah, I saw that while making notes. Not a fan. Uh, you think? I mean, I know the series has been going for 20 years. You don't have to recycle names. He obviously ran off with his girlfriend. Come on, it's been two months already. Although it'll never be worse than Persona 2 having two characters named Maya. That's a lie. That Chisato bitch tricked him. Everyone knows that girl's bad news. Call him Bruce. <laughs> uh, I probably will call him Yosuke, uh, Yusuke, or whatever. But I'll probably get them real mixed up. <laughs> the whole time. Uh, you know what, there's no advantage to talking to Mark and Guy and Yukino. Yosuke was popular with the girls, but no one's seen him in two months. Wasn't Yosuke? Okay, Yosuke. Okay, okay, so this is P4 Yosuke and not P5 Yusuke. <laughs> I always hated how close their names were together, too. <laughs> um... Yosuke's best friends with Maki. If you visit her, ask her about it. Must. Finish map. I'll make it worse for you. Chishadu is the name of Jojima's Rife. Okay, that's not great either. Uh, but at least she was dead. <laughs> Hey, I had a weird dream. There was a girl and she was saying help me. Was it a vision? Is there really a girl waiting for me to rescue her? Wow, that's awesome. Kenta Yokoichi, nicknamed Toro. His love of food has made him physically strong, but emotionally fragile. Oh, is that muscle? Nice. Nice, Kenta. Yeah, you bulk up, boy. Damn. Dude, guess what I saw? Taro asked out Ayasa and got rejected on the spot. Ayuri's still following around, though. Guess she doesn't like fucking ripped dudes. I no longer care if it's if they actually meant that. He's now jacked canonically. I've ch I've made him jacked. At the very end of the hall, there's a gray door that leads outside to the gym. Okay. I'm not going to talk to my party members, because I don't think there's any reason to. There wasn't in P2. 
They would just say, like, I'm a party member. Beep boop. Don't you think the derelict like building should be torn down? Places that only attract hooligans. Ha! <laughs> hooligans? Seriously? What a point, Dexter. Ha! Point, Dexter? What a point, Dexter. <laughs> Chunky is now a JoJo character. Won't you pipe down? I was saying, wouldn't it attract hooligans? Certainly, I'd hate to see that happen. Okay, mm-hmm, yep, mm-hmm, yep. This is like a puzzle I have to solve all these desks in my way. <laughs> I had a weird dream. It's been really bothering me. Do you want to hear about it? Yeah, I'll hear about it. Hit me with it. it. Takes place in a blue room. I can hear a piano and singing, and there's an odd man sitting down. What do you think that means? Did this bitch go to the velvet room? What? This is a random unnamed side character with a persona? Well, now we know where Akechi came from. Um, now you, you're gonna go to the hospital, right? Yuko Himino, Maki's friend. She works part-time to support her family. I hate to ask, but could you tell Maki I'll give back that book next time I go visit her? Sure. Um, thanks. I'm sorry to ask you to go out of your way like that. It was a really good book, so I wanted to read it again before I return it. That good, huh? What's it called? Um, Gate to Paradise? Well, that's deep. I didn't know Maki was into that kind of thing. If you enjoyed it that much, why not simply buy your own copy? Uh, well, it's kind of expensive, and my brothers and sisters need new clothes. Nanjo, you moron. Don't you know she works part-time to help her family out? All right, well, let's get going, but we'll be sure to pass on your message. Occasionally, they'll say stuff that adds to the character, like, if you talk to Ellen over the course of the game, you learn she's an eccentric weirdo who is a little too into the occult and wants to fuck the earring boy. I just talked to everyone. Oh, okay. All right, talk to everyone. We'll start doing that. Hope we probably didn't miss anything so far. I mean, we're like 11 minutes into the game. Yuka seems to be an airhead, but I think sometimes she's working at it. <sighs> hey, where's Ayasa? Wasn't she with you? She promised to go out, but she totally ditched. I'm thinking I might, like, just go ahead on my own. It's really weird, though. She said totally I don't know it. I don't know what I did sometime. Then I go, then I go, and then I don't understand it. Oh. No, at this point, all they say is, hey, you pierced your fucking hospital now. Are you guys going to the hospital on the northeast corner of town? It's a pretty long walk. Good luck with that. This is how people talk. Does this Nounjo woman never stop running her mouth? Wait. Does this woman never stop running her mouth? Okay, I'm going to keep inserting people's names awkwardly into conversations like that. How did the moon phase change? Oh, because I was unconscious. Oh my god, how long was I unconscious? They didn't bring me to a real hospital? Hey, now yeah, we're still going to the hospital, right? Mark's butterfly uh, pin reminds me of... Uh, Jorno. The moon changes as you walk. Oh my god! How long have I been in this school? <laughs> That's not normal. We should get that looked at. <laughs> Holy shit! Whole months are flying by as I'm in this school. Yeah, Maki's an awesome artist. Come on now, yeah, let's get to the hospital. 
awesome artist. Jesus Christ, did she make that? You've seen one of Maki's paintings. She won an award for her Gate to Paradise. The painting I saw of Maki's had a strong, raw sense of emotion to it. We could really use more members. Maki's sick and Shisato's gone missing. Do you know those two? Yeah, I know those two. Well, Maki's pieces are incredible. She's won several awards for them. And friend Shisato isn't very good, but she's had better luck with men. That's a weird thing you've just added to that, sir, but okay. Okay, there's just a carved marble statue. I have to assume a student didn't make that, because Michelangelo's David took seven fucking years. So I can only imagine the time it takes to carve a marble statue is a lot of fucking time. Well, apparently time in this game passes as we walk down a hallway, so maybe it took them like a day. Sorting no records is no task for a student council president. That's literally your job. I think floor three at this point. Kind of Dory would have refused to do it at this point of pride, so I refuse too. It's all part of my quest to be more like him. Student council president, leader of St. Hermland Student Council, isn't a wild about his job. Did I learn that fact? He's trying to emulate Kind of Dory, the eighth student council president. You haven't heard of that big shot Sebek? Uh, he graduated from here. I would be weary of any organization called Sebek. He's still young, but he's a branch president of a big company now. I really hate this guy, huh? We, can't we go to the hospital see Ma- I mean, go to the hospital? Well, yeah, wasn't I supposed to go to the third floor or some shit? I was supposed to find a gray door. If he can't handle the meager power of the student council, then he's no man at all. I bet we'd be better off with anyone but him as president. <laughs> Damn! All right, student council president not uh, popular among among the among the, the the crew, as I will take to calling them until we have a better name. Those are true colors, but he's no dummy. He's got the faculty on his side. I hear he's never been reprimanded. Talk about unfair. Super extremely evil corporation. I mean, it's literally named after the fucking alligator that eats you when you're deemed evil from Egyptian mythology. So, yeah. <laughs> Our president does nothing but sit around and bark orders. Who voted for this guy? If I was president, I'd make him a guy like him work till he killed over. Oh, is that our school flag? It looks fancy. I don't think Sebek is just an alligator. I think it's an alligator, a hippopotamus, and a lion. But don't quote me on that, but I believe it's an alligator, hippopotamus, lion. The Great Door is literal if you start at the nurse's office and go straight to the end uh, and turn right. See, that's what it is in the PlayStation version, but I followed those directions and went up the stairs. They call him Devil Boy, but the staff, he'll tell you, is a load of crap. I know much more about the occult, though. I can never tell the uninitiated. But I have a persona. The way I see it, there must be demons who get along well and those that don't. If demons who hated each other made up, I'm sure it'd be disastrous. Oh, interesting. So I wonder if there's a, a persona mechanic for that. Like, if you have a certain persona in your inventory, and you try and persuade another demon that doesn't like that demon, maybe they don't get along well. Like, like if you're trying to, like, seduce Satan to your side, but you're, like, rocking Michael, Satan will be like, Ew, get out of here with your Michael bitch. You see that guy over there? The one they call Devil Boy? 
He tripped and fell over again today during PE. It was freaking hilarious. He can't even do a single push-up. Lamer. <laughs> Lamer? Okay. Those two over there are making fun of Devil Boy, but I prefer Devil Boy to them. At least he doesn't act all high and mighty. If you like Devil Boy so much, why don't you marry him? Sir, please go to a hospital. Oh, it's you, Toto. Ha! I'm investigating. This okay. This guy's evil, right? I should just go all out. I'm investigating the seven mysteries of Saint Hamlin High. Want to know what I've learned? Maybe some other time. Totsumo Kururi, nicknamed the Devil Boy. He's an expert in the occult, but frequently has incorrect information, so he's not actually an expert in the occult. <laughs> that kind of happens in Devil Summoner Soul Hackers. I'd love to join you, but you got that bitch Lalorn, so I can't go with you. Oh, okay, yeah. I mean, they kind of implied it was a mechanic, but... But it, at least they did it at one point. I'm not sure how fond of I am of that, actually. To be. <laughs> what are we doing at library? Let's hurry and see. I mean, get checked out. Okay, okay, Jesus. Hold your fucking horses, Mark. What a shabby collection. The library at home is so much better stocked. Why is there not a one on his ascot in his profile picture, but there is an a, a one on his profile picture in the cutscene? Ow, I keep- I love the sound effect when you hit the wall. Instead of just preventing you, you- it sounds like you smash your dumb fucking face into a wall. Brown-haired student, Nurse Natsumi- Nurse Natsumi is hot as hell. I love that mature air she has. Oh, really? Then why don't you have her pack your lunches from now on? Oh, please, not that. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have had anything. I mean, you're way hotter, br girl. Gr girlfriend, I assume. Childhood friend. Future waifu. That reminds me. I heard Nor Nurse Natsumi just had a breakup. I wonder why. Even if she's a bad cook, you could just live off convenience store food. Okay, okay, you know what? You're going to the doghouse tonight, boy. Guys our age tend to go for older women. Yeah, it's because you're like three years old. Of course you go for older women. There aren't any... <laughs> There's not enough available options. Seriously, guys, the sun's going down. Are we going to the hospital or not? Bitch, the sun's not going down. We've spent three fucking days here. I'm not interested in this sort of foolishness. Shit's locked. And I have walked out of the room. Stuff and nonsense. Curses are nothing more than superstition. Didn't we just get shot with lightning? A secret shortcut? Hey, must mean the hole in the wall. Okay. That sounds vaguely sexual. Looks like Sebek's reputation is at an all-time low. Well, they're called Sebek. Maybe they should have called themselves something that wasn't Sebek. I'm hungry. I'm gonna get a snack. It'll be easy if I use the secret shortcut. Should give it a try, too. Hold on the walls where you gotta go. Oh. You what? I can't just walk out the front door. Like, no way am I going to walk by Sebek Building at night. That company's been cursed ever since they tore down the Haunted Mansion. <laughs> That's where the gym and clubs are. Okay. Shit's locked. Is there a way to open a map? Do I have a map option? Oh, there is a map option. Cool, I can see how complete I am. It's 
square. Yep, got it. Thank you. Oh, does a 100% map include the stairs? Oh, it does. Shit's locked. You quite enjoy idling the time away with frivolity, don't you? At this rate, the sun will have set before the exam examinations are uh, through. Huh? There are other trees like that one in the infirmary? I saw a beautiful tree in the forest east of the station. It looked exactly like the one Nurse Nats be put in the infirmary. I feel at peace when I look at that tree. It was the strangest thing, although it did talk to me in a deep, ominous voice. We have been in this school for seven days now. The police station straight north from here, right? I don't fucking know. Don't don't ask me, Mark. I don't wanna go to cram school. I just wanna stay home and sleep. You can't, you need to study. Let's go together, okay? Why don't we meet at the subway entrance? The subway entrance? That's north through the Sun Mall and all the way right, yeah? Here's the best part. When you get to the hospital, the first thing they say is, there's a little time before the exam. Let's go see Mary. <laughs> you thought about what to do after grad? Col grad? College isn't in my plans. I'm going to become a journalist. We'll be preparing for our college entrance exam soon. Naturally, I plan to pass with top marks and enter the college of my choice. Hey, uh, we're not supposed to be in here. Let's just go to the hospital. Oh my god, Mark, shut up. You're supposed to be able to see your future self when you play at Persona. I wonder if I should try it. Will I be in college this time next year? You're supposed to see your future self? I don't believe that. Oh, give me a break. If you have time to play that Persona game, you have time to study. Moron, you promise we go to the same college together. I'm really glad this game has a map, or I would be so confused. Whoa, hang on. Where the fuck am I? Oh, this is the first floor. Okay. Alright, sure. Shit's locked. I want to point out that the phase of the moon that I'm on right now just says moon. The nurse's <laughs> office isn't on the first floor. No, it was on the second floor. This Sebit curse is a load of crap. I bet they're making biological weapons. Why is everyone so pissed at Sevic? It's just a regular company. With a really unfortunate name. I can't discount it. Conador is a man who wouldn't hesitate to do such things. I didn't know you were this interested in rumors and gossip. Here's a hot tip. We need to get to the hospital. Oh my god, Yukino. Get off it. I'm busy exploring every single room and square tile of the school. That's a perfectly valid use of my time. I'm 
stories about Sebek tend to be unpleasant. That aside, we should head to the hospital. Oh my god, you too, Nanjo, the last domino finally falls. Why originally the nurse's office was on the first floor, right by the principal's office in the broom closet that later uh, becomes the velvet room, then the school becomes a dungeon. Well, okay, now hang on. I have a problem with that. If the broom closet becomes uh, becomes the velvet room, then how, what if I wanted a broom? Did you hear any of those weird rumors about the Sebek building? God, I've heard every rumor about the Sebek building, rumor lover Greenwald. Some people have heard moaning and seen red eyes peering through the windows. It's supposed to be cursed since they leveled the haunted mansion to build it. The haunted mansion, man, that takes me back. I used to go play there a lot, that old bat. I mean, my mom got mad at me. Well, Mark, you are just not a pleasant person, are you? Yeah, they tore that place down and put up the Sebek building last year. Stories about Sebek tend to be unpleasant. That aside, we should head to the hospital. There's traps in it. Well, but do I get anything for 100%ing the map? What's the game where I get something for 100%ing the map? Reiji Keto, huh? Oh, okay. There's nothing. Okay. Is it Eternal Punishment? Is that the one where I have to 100% the map? He keeps to himself. I feel as though he does so deliberately. That girl supposedly got a thing for Reiji. Not that I'm jealous or anything. Um, there's a guy named Reiji in your class, right? No matter how much I hang around your homeroom at break or after school, I never see him. How am I supposed to strike up a conversation? The romantic air of mystery he has. Oh, but yeah. We don't have time to deal with this nonsense. Let's get to the hospital. Oh my god, Yukino, get off me. Alright, I'll stop fucking around then. But it's so satisfying watching the map be complete. Uh, let's see, that's an exit. That's a locked door. Also, putting the nurse's office on the second floor is stupid because then if you explore a floor uh, two first, you'll read the other stuff about Sebek first. This game has a sprint button. Eternal punishment. Okay. Well, at least we got that out immediately. Gambling is a man's hobby, and money girls are a must for every casino. Shaw, slots, blackjack, code breaker. Uh, I can't wait till I'm old enough to go. Isn't gambling illegal in Japan? Or was it not when this game was made? That dude got yelled at the other day for betting on rich man, poor man, and glass. Let's ditch this gambling freak and go to the hospital before I lose it, okay? Oh yeah, there was a casino in, um... I was gonna say there was a casino in in uh, Innocent Sin, but there wasn't a casino in Innocent Sin. There was a casino in Innocent Sin because you made a building turn into a casino. <laughs> Code breaker. Yes, I used to play that with Yamaoka when I was small. Oh my god! Engage warp speed! Oh, no, the nurse's office is on the first floor. That's interesting. I didn't have any map completion branching off from the nurse's office. Now, yeah, you really should be on your way to Mikage Hospital. I put a new plan... Oh, all right. Oh, there's the school exit. So I'm looking for a hole in the wall, right? I was totally satisfied with the move speed, and then I found the sprint button. Ugh, it's Hamya. I hate that guy. Cheese it, Noya! Isn't there one decent teacher here besides Miss Psycho and the principal? What's the matter? Are the school gates closed? If we don't hurry, visiting hours of the hospital may end. Oh my god, it's fucking Hanya. 
sprint though in the original was only in, uh, on the map, which was wildly different than the map in this version. Oh, uh, okay. I don't remember what this man's voice was. Um, who told you kids that you could go through here? If you want to get outside, the school gates are there for a reason. Our school's swarming with degenerates like you. Oishi is far too lenient. Now get out of here. I'm going to call a specialist and have this blacked off. Vice Principal Hanya, known as Hamya, among students who despise his extreme strictness. Oh shit, I'm in the gym now. Woo! Uh, in this one map is a static image and you move a cursor. Um, in the original it was 3D and you moved a little marker. I don't have many ties with the gym, of, of course. I suppose I can let it slide. This place would be great for practicing dance moves if I had a big mirror. Okay, Lisa. I heard a student second year Yosuke went missing along with his girlfriend. Sevik's doing if you ask me. Nah, proof. Male intuition. Can we hurry and get to the hospital yet? Yukino, calm your shit. Sound system's all good in the new gym. Concert's gonna be bitching. I'm gonna skip sports day and hole up in the studio to practice. Club rooms are a place to remember when you come back and get your armor. Okay. Gotta go fast! Drama Club. Hey, we haven't decided which play we're doing for the Culture Festival, have we? I heard there was a traditional play we used to perform. Why did I do that? I think it was called The Snow. Absolutely not. That one's off limits. I'll decide soon. Give me some time. Oh, is this is the Snow Queen like um like uh the 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 play of the Yellow King or the Hanged King or whatever you want to call it? Whatever reference you want to make. It's a pick your own reference adventure book. This school has a traditional play. News to me. Are you interested in joining the club? If not, please leave. You're in our eye lines. Okay, damn, bitch. Now I don't want to join. I have an earring, so I would have naturally fit in with your drama club, but then you were a bitch. The president seemed a little touchy. Why'd she get so upset? St. Hermelin won drama concourse nine years ago, too. But the trophy from that year is missing. Wonder what happened to it. Probably turned evil. Who needs a pledge? Let me bust a move up on stage. Snow? Was he going to suggest the Snow Queen? Okay, I didn't realize that was a punching bag. I thought it was a sausage. I could lose some weight myself. Boxing is so cool. Looks like it would hurt, though. Yeah, it fucking does. You're getting punched in the face. And body, go oh God. Do you want to join the boxing club? Well, let's get examined before that. Dieting club member. I'm trying to lose some weight. Even the boxing gloves are starting to look like candy. What the fu- Oh, this is the archery club. They just let you shoot arrows at walls in this school? Bows and arrows aren't my thing. I prefer razor blades. Okay, Yukino, I didn't remember you being that thug. I heard a bunch of bows are here. I think I'll borrow one and mess around with it next time. I agree, archery is interesting. But don't forget to go to the hospital. Oh my god. Archery is intelligent, mature sport. Don't have a bow? We'll lend you one. Cool. We can get a bow from here. Mm 
What the fuck is this room? Oh, this is Kendo. Why are there just pictures of women in bikinis in the Kendo room? Tadashi, you idiot. Why do you keep messing up the club room? Tamaki. Uh, a transfer student who joined the fencing club. She's always arguing with Tadashi. Why do I know the name Tamaki? Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Aren't these the, uh, uh, IF characters that also join the Kuzunoha Detective Agency? La la la, I'm not listening. We can do whatever we want. Sheesh, Tamaki, who pissed in your cornflakes this morning? Tadashi, a lazy member of the fencing club who quarrels with Tamaki every day. What did you say? I'm gonna rip this trash off the wall right now. Hey, I called it. What are you doing to my goddess? Goddess my ass, you pervert. You're the perviest perv to ever perv. Tadashi isn't an if character. Oh, okay. Ugh, you hag. You're a haggity hag who hags all hagging day. Yep, you're people. Ugh, yeah, I'm kind of busy here. What is it? I'm a little busy here. I feel like... I feel like playing the early games is like me circling the drain of an inevitable if playthrough. Ugh, these two are like this every day. I'm surprised they're not tired of it. Tamaki's a transfer student, but she's good enough to place in tournaments. But she never wants to talk about her last school. Did something happen? I imagine a few things happened. Honestly, the idiots populating our sports club. It's all a bit much. Leave him alone. You know how some people are. They fight because they care. What a half-assed job. If you're gonna bomb a wall, you gotta do it more style. Ifs characters are Tamaki, Yumi, Reiko, Charlie, Akira, and Hazuma. Alright. Oh, this looks like the last room. This is the... Dance club? Ballet, huh? The Nutcracker's kinda neat, I always thought. Fun dream world the girl saw on Christmas Eve. Huh. <sighs> hey, what's that look for? I happen to like ballet. Something wrong with that? Nope, nope. Please don't cut me. It was nice when they rebuilt the gym and we finally got our own room. Back when we had to change the classroom, someone could have seen us. Wait, were you one of the pervs doing that? Did you know that toe shoes are actually really hard? I was pretty surprised the first time I put on a pair. I get fidgety around this stuff. Come on, let's go to the hospital. Nanjo, I need you to stop standing in corners. Now, uh, Namaoka used to take me to the ballet when I was small. I suppose he was trying to cultivate my aesthetic sensibilities. Now I wear a cyan ascot. So, joke's on him. That translation sucks. The original line was, leave those idiots alone, they fight because they like each other. Huh. I'm a speed man! Look at me speed! I've entered the nurse's office. I'm gonna get yelled at. Miss Oishi is so kind. She loves flowers so much she cares for them as if they were her own children. Which is good, because she killed her own children. I have a part-time work today. Let's hurry and get to the hospital and get this over with. Oh my god, Yukino! Our principal's a cool lady, but she can be a little too lovey-dovey. This megalith shard, it's a very precious cultural artifact. We should probably be worried that there's a magical fucking item in our courtyard. Why is there always a magical item in our courtyard? <laughs> Why was this also a thing in Persona 2? Who built it? For what purpose? Never ceases to fascinate me. Why, hello, Nawiya. Are you taking a walk, too? It's been part of my daily routine ever since I was a girl. Praying to the guardian deity that everyone grows up into fine adults. 
Principal Hoshi, the principal of St. Hermlin High. Whoops. She... something... children. She kills children. She's a children murderer. Here I'm on stone. This megalith was excavated when the school was first built in 1963. It's made of uh, thamatite and possesses an abnormal magnetism. What is with the magnets? Are persona magnetic or some shit? Legend has it it was heavenly divine. It was a heavenly being known as Hiramon, dropped it from the sky to be Makage Cho's guardian stone. Here's the place of interest. Go to the residence, Yin Yan, Sun Mall, and then the hospital. All right. That's an interesting way of saying go everywhere. Uh, I think I'm in a courtyard. I thought this was the exit. This is not the exit. This is just a courtyard. I don't know how to leave this building. I've found the exit to this building. You're all so slow. You must seize the moment like myself. There's a reason it's said that one youth passes quickly. No, see, made the joke was that I was going to go everywhere. Not that you listed everywhere. That Nanjo pisses me off so bad. I'll find a chink in his armor someday. Ugh, I am not a Mark fan. Maso and Kay are both such children. This is an old man in a butler's outfit. Young master, Yamaoka, the Nanjo family's butler. He's taken care of Nanjo since he was an e since the heir was an infant. Y Yamaoka. Oh my, Master K is leaving the premises with a crowd of friends. I'm I'm so happy to see this. Master K. Yamaoka. I've told you time and again never to call me that, you dummy. Did you just call him dummy? Ha! <laughs> no, I, uh... Oh, be silent, Masao. Look, Yamoka, I don't need a ride today. Just go back without me. Oh, my. Will you be going out on the town with your chums, young master? I'm only going to the hospital. Stop calling me that. The hospital? Heavens. I do hope you haven't hurt yourself, young master. Enough. Let's be on our way now, yeah? Yamoka, do not follow us. I'm following you right now! Alright, we can go ahead and, um... We can go ahead and...